friends. Welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Uh, I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you guys and I'm excited because I went to um, a different store and I did find some new stuff. So that's always fun and always exciting. Um, I'm trying to think of this. Yes, there was two things that I definitely needed to get from there. Um, one was this Rotel diced tomatoes and green chilies. Now, if you mix this with, um, if you guys seen one of my previous hauls of the Tastefully Simple, um, if you mix this with about two teaspoons of that seasoning from Tastefully Simple, and it makes salsa. So, I needed that, so I got two of those. So, I have one for now and one for the future. And I also went in there for picture frames. Um, let me show you. Uh, where did I put them? Oh, here they are. <laughs> I got stuff everywhere, guys. So, I need some picture frames to put in pictures I had printed out for my husband and I's um, anniversary. So, I got this one. And then I got this white one. And I got another one. Let me pull it out here. And I got this one, and it says grateful, thankful, and blessed. So I thought that was really pretty. I got those three frames. And frames are not something that I typically go in there for, so I was like pleasantly surprised that I found such cute ones. Because um, I don't know if they typically carry them or it just so happen to go on a good day and, and they had them. Um, I did also go in there for this. Um, you guys have seen me haul these before. These are the strawberry shortcake bars, and you get three of them. Uh, my daughter really liked them, and she's like, Mama, can you pick some more of those up? So I got two boxes of those, and then my son really loves the orange cream bars. And so I picked up another package because he's almost out of his. And then, while I was there, I found these as well. And these are the Toffee Crunch Bars, and you get three, um, but they just looked delicious. So I said, yes, please. And it says it contains milk, soy, um, sugar, corn syrup, coconut oil, and like other natural flavors. But yeah, toffee, to toffee was one of the flavors. So those sounded really good and I was like oh yeah and then I must have had a sweet treat while I was in there because I also seen this milk chocolate um, caramel filled bar and I thought well for those every once in a while when I get a little craving of chocolate and I do love chocolate and peanut butter and chocolate caramel or just chocolate or chocolate and peanuts so um, have you noticed like a chocolate pattern but um, <laughs> so I said yeah I'll go ahead that looks really good I'll go ahead and get that and the next time I want a little bite of chocolate, they have, it has like different um, pieces that you could break off. So, you know, eat a little chocolate here, eat a little chocolate there, you know. <laughs> and then I also got these Butterfinger Fun Size, because I don't know about you guys, but every once in a while, like after I eat, like lunch or dinner, and I noticed it too, like if it was something salty, more salty that I ate, that I get like this like little sweet craving or chocolate craving so yeah so I got those for that craving and then um, I got these cap these Lance um, Lance brand Captain Wafers and this is in the cream cheese and chives because my husband likes to take these to work but he also likes to take them out when he's golfing so I got them for him and um, it is a six pack of four so you get a lot in there for a dollar I got those for him, and then um, also for him, now trust me, it's about to be in the 90s this weekend. It is certainly not a soup weather or soup season, but I got this because when I was walking by, I was like, that sounds good, and I know he would like it, and I also like to have it, that kind of stuff on stock, and if there's ever a day when it's kind of a little cooler, and it's rainy, and you don't feel like fixing lunch, or he doesn't feel like pack anything for his lunch he can take a can of soup to work so or if it's just left there until the fall it's left there until the fall whatever so this is a Campbell's home style clam chowder 
He likes clam chowder. And then also got um, the beef barley soup because I thought that one sounded good. And every once in a while I get in like a soup kick and I want some soup and it's just like the other week I was at Food Line and I had picked some stuff up and I seen that they had those little SpaghettiO and meatballs and I haven't had those in years and I was like, oh gosh, that sounds good. I just had a weird craving for it. So, um, so I got those. I got two cans of those. I actually ate one for lunch this past week. And then I got the Campbell's um, loaded potato soup and I know he'll love that. And then I also got the hearty ham and bean soup. This looks and sounds delicious. So I got that. And then, let me see. Ooh, excuse me, guys. I have not had any iced coffee today at all. Or yesterday. Um, I found this and I, it just looks so good. I was like, oh yes, please. And I'm not a big jello eater although jello is really good for you and um it, but it's just not something that I, that I eat very often but I found the starburst all pink strawberry gelatin and I said yes I will be making that and maybe I'll make it into a taste test you never know um they also had the cherry but I didn't buy the cherry um not a you guys have heard me say it before if you watch my videos enough. Um, I do love like um, fresh cherries, but other than that, I'm not a real big cherry eater. But yeah, so I got that. And then let's get into some of the home type things. So if you watched my previous video, the kids and I completed the uh, elephant puzzle that Ellen had sent me which my son was a huge help in that, and I do appreciate that. And, um, and of course my daughter and I worked on it too. It was, just, it was just fun family time. And I said in this modern day of technology, if you can get your kids to sit down with you and do a board game, cards, puzzles. For us, we also do bike riding. If you can get your kids to sit down and do those kind of things, it is huge, especially when they're getting older because, um, you know, they don't always want to hang out with you. So when they do, like, I am definitely taking advantage of it. Um, so thank you, Ellen, for that puzzle because we did enjoy that. And so I wanted to put it on something to glue it because um, I like to put it up on my wall. Um, it was a special memory, not only for Ellen giving it to me, but also, um, or gifting it to me, but also for the kids and I, we've done it together and we can look back and I could, you know, put a date on it and be like, you know, we did that. So I found these Jot uh, four piece poster board and I thought, well, that might work. Um, it's kind of neat that there's four. I don't know that I'll need these other three. I may send it out in friend mail or if I do another puzzle, I may put it with that. Um, but yeah, so I got that for that purpose. And then I got this um, anniversary card. I thought that was pretty for a friend and then um oh I was so excited I found this cookbook and it's still in the paper the poor girl at the store she was having a really hard time trying to scan it her scanner was not working um but there this is Laura Weathers simply desserts over 130 tried and true dessert recipes worth sharing and let me tell you what some of these desserts it looks amazing. It says, from my grandmother's inviting coffee cake to my son's favorite banana bread, I'm so excited to share my best and most loved dessert recipes with you. Whether you're looking for an everyday dessert or something holiday special, you'll find it in all it, find it all in this cookbook, including lots of baking basics that I've learned over the years. Your sweet tooth will never be the same. I really wish that I could have found more than this one because I really would have liked to have, um, you know, sent these out. This book, you, you can see it's $21.95 and I paid $1, so that's really exciting. Uh, but look at this maple, are you kidding me? Phenomenal maple bacon donuts. Like, yes please. I never thought of putting maple and bacon, not maple and bacon together because I've had maple bacon, but I've never thought of putting maple bacon 
a donut and a donut together, you know, if you've ever thought of that, but, and Billy's all-time favorite cookies, and look at that, looks scrumptious, so you know I'll be making, uh, yeah, I'll be making stuff out of this for sure, spiced apple dessert bars, yes please, yeah, so super, super excited, praline pumpkin pie, oh my goodness, just, Oh my goodness, peanut butter and chocolate cheesecake. Look at that. Goodness, this is, oh, I, I'm looking forward to just having like five minutes just to sit down <laughs> and look at this book. Just give me five minutes just to sit down and look at it. So, um, so I'm really excited about that book. And uh, we actually, the kids and I did pick up donuts today. We went to Krispy Kreme. Oh my gosh. Fridays are like our, um, pizza night we always have always tried to do like pizza night on Fridays and it's tradition that I had as a kid as well like my family we always did like pizza night on Fridays so it's just something I just try to incorporate with our family but um we got pizza from a different town um at a, a really good um pizzeria and while we were there uh we went down the street to Krispy Kreme and got donuts and so yeah so much for trying to lose weight right <laughs> I'll work it off I'll work it off anyway let me get back to this haul so I also picked up this eucalyptus potpourri scented potpourri um I'll show you guys so I bought this and I'm going to actually glue that onto here to make like a rustic uh, wreath as a gift so, uh, when I get that finished, I'll show you guys. I also bought four of these because I have a beautiful vase that's just sitting in my attic that I really want to put something in. And when I've seen these, it's like, these are so rustic and beautiful. I cannot believe these are $1. Like, are you kidding me? So, yeah, I got four of those. I'll have to incorporate a picture at the end with that in there. Um, okay, so on to some beauty things. Oh, well, let's do this one first. So I got this for a friend. It says Crazy Cat's Paul Markers. Thought those were so cute for her. Um, I did get two packs of TP. Try to stay stocked up on that kind of stuff. Y'all know me. I try to stay stocked up. I did get some nail polish remover because I was out of nail polish remover. Um, I was super excited. I have not found those little round secret, um deodorants that people have been finding but I found three new ones I hadn't seen before this is the power stick and it's zero percent aluminum and this is cucumber mint deodorant okay so I got that one I got uh one each of the or um two each of these one for myself and one for my daughter and um well I got her two of these actually I got her two of the teen spirit by lady speed stick and this is in what's called pink crush that smells nice. And then I also got the Suave Rosemary and Mint deodorant. And it's cruelty free, no parabens, no dyes, and it's formulated without the aluminum. Um, I say those sort of things, those aluminums and things are the kind of things that can cause cancers. So that is nice when they show that it does not have it. So I got those three, and we are definitely stocked up on deodorant for the summer. Body wash and deodorant. <laughs> so we're all ready to smell good for summer, right? That's a good thing. <laughs> anybody wants them to be anybody to be stinky, right? <laughs> so I also got this polishing cloth and it says preps. It says just run the cloth under warm water and squeeze out excess water. Use the cloth to wipe away um, cleanser or anything like that. Um, and then you just, after you use it, you rinse it and you hang it to dry. Um, machine wash it and tumble dry low after every third use. So, and it's like 89% of polyester. So yeah, so I got that for friend mail. It actually goes over there for friend mail. And then, um, so I got this for friend mail too. Isn't that pretty? A little hair piece. And then um, I got these for my daughter and I. I thought these were really pretty. Aren't those pretty? Oh my gosh. I love the, the hot pink and that purple and those pearls. Oh my gosh. So beautiful. I love those. So I got that. I was super excited about that. 
And then I found this hard candy, um, 12 hour long, uh, sheer in the setting spray. I was excited to find that because I really like the setting sprays. And then I got this Neutrogena Deep Clean Purifying Hydrogel Mask. It says it instantly refreshes and soothes skin, leaves skin feeling purified, and gives skin a healthy looking glow. There's that. And then um, I found the lip, the LA Colors Lip Oil in Grape. And I was super excited because... I was recently gifted lip oil and I love it and I hadn't like I hadn't bought any or hadn't I don't think I'd even seen any um and this is I'm sure it smells so good it's great so it's got to smell good right so I'm gonna finish showing you guys the rest of my haul because it is a nice size haul there's, a, there's just a few things left though so I just wanted to try this though Oh gosh, yes, you can really smell that grape. Oh yeah. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Then I found this um, Hard Candy Fox in a Box. And this is in number 1342 Glamour Girl. Glamour Girl. And it is a, um, it says it's a marbleized baked highlighter. And it says scratch and sniff. So the highlighter must smell like pina colada so never heard of that but there you go there's that and then I found two of these buckables have you guys seen the buckables um, where they have like the little um, elastic bands that you put on your um, your on your wrist and um, it helps keep the mosquitoes away well these are the repellent wipes it says family friendly botanical formula DEET free which is huge you gotta try to get the stuff guys without the DEET deep that's very bad for you and you get two wipes and it's a, a repel with essential oils so I got two of those because honestly the bugs whether it be flies uh, North Carolina water bugs which to me they look like cockroaches or um, even the spiders here, the mosquitoes, to me, everything, all the bugs here in North Carolina look like pterodactyls. They're huge, much larger than the ones in West Virginia. I don't know what they're eating, what they're feeding off of, what kind of chemical they're taking in the body, but <laughs> they're gross. They're huge. And I don't like it. <laughs> and then, um, so yeah, so I got that to keep those away. <laughs> Um, and then I found, last but not least, I found these. I got two of these. This is the Brightening Gemstone Mini Masks. And it says Quartz Balance uh, with Quartz Extract. And it's made in Korea. And so that's what that looks like. And that's what it looks like. It comes in like a little three-piece. So, yeah. So that is my haul, guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thank you for staying with me this long. I never usually do videos this long. But it was kind of a kind of a big haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys share it, like it. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. And I hope you'll be a part of my YouTube family. And I hope you guys have a wonderful, blessed evening. And until next time, bye y'all.